Hey everyone, I wanted to discuss today about writing prompts and specifically this prompt for using market research for business consultants. Oh, I realized that I'm making the cardinal sin of using a ring light and wearing glasses. Okay, um, anyways, let's carry on. So I've been exploring prompts and just beyond the, the standard write a roadmap or write a business proposal um, and really getting depth, precision, out of prompts. Now I've come across a user from Reddit that has designed a prompt engineer. I've tweaked and tailored a prompt that could be effective for you if you're doing research uh, and analysis for consulting. So I'll go ahead and I'll put this prompt in the comments of this video so you can go ahead and copy and paste it and try yourself. So let's go on over to ChatGTP. I say ChatGTP, ChatGPT. I'm gonna mess this up um, and that's that. So let's go ahead so, and look at the prompt. So the prompt says, uh, please simulate this prompt. And basically what I'm asking chat GPT to do is uh, simulate itself being a market research and analysis tool. Uh, so I'll go ahead and press enter and then start simulating the prompt. So you'll see it has started to simulate that it is a market research and analysis tool. And I'll go ahead and I'll input some data that, yeah, just some dummy data that I'm looking for. And this is why I should have worn my glasses. <laughs> okay, I'll go ahead and press enter and let's see what it will give as the output. Okay, so here we see the output, it says, Thank you very much. Uh, this is something, a request that we can certainly do. And then it will reiterate what we had asked it uh, back. So it will say, we'll provide insights. Great. So then I can go ahead and type provide an overview of this report. Now I have hit some glitches when you say, hey, great, please provide the full report. It will say, eh -eh. as an AI model, I cannot give you the full report. So it's helpful in this context to say, give me an overview of, of the report, give an example of this report and so on. Great, so now that we have a full overview of the report, let's go ahead and break down some of the sections into further detail. You can provide the prompt now. Please provide information on the market analysis and it will summarize information on the market analysis. Now keep in mind that ChatGPT oh, Chat GPT is confidently sometimes incorrect. So make sure that you're always verifying this information with outside sources. Apologies for not being on camera. I need to put my glasses on because I can't read. <laughs> but uh, you can always go ahead and ask for more in-depth information. For example, uh, please provide information about market size. So it will give you a bit more precise and tailored information on this. And there you have it. Great, so effectively what I've done in this video is show you a prompt to have a more in-depth market research and analysis tool that you can use with ChatGPT. Um, I've showed you some of the prompts that you can put in to get information out of it. Um, also too, it is important to be mindful that when you plug in your data, that if you ask, please provide a full report, you may receive an error that will say, sorry, can't do that. So the workaround here is to provide the overview of the report, which is fine and dandy, and then ask ChatGPT for more information for each section. For example, we covered the market analysis and it then spit out uh, information. I shouldn't say spit out, that sounds very vulgar. It then generated information that was more in depth. So it uh, covered market size, key players, government policies and uh, incentives, competitive landscape and market forecasts. So you can do that with each section and yeah, that's that. So I hope that you found this video useful. Go ahead and like and subscribe if you want more information and weekly newsletter videos, newsletter videos, news updates, newsletters. I'm a millennial, so whatever. Um, and that's it. So thank you for watching and have a wonderful, wonderful evening, morning or afternoon.